hello guys in this video i'm going to show you how you can make consistent money every day from uh trading cryptocurrencies uh spot trading generally and then how you can use royal q to trade uh, i've made video before where i talked about royal q i talked about how you can also trade manually on binance if you don't have the money to actually activate your royal q and then i made the video for it's, it's over a month now i've made so those videos i talked about nomics i talked about lunar crush and how you can use lunar crush predictions with nomics predictions in order to look for the coin to trade and um, by so doing you are going to be much more profitable and of course uh, I've been profitable and even up to now I am still making profit and I think it's necessary I uh, give an update on how well my royal key is doing and the coins I've bought are currently doing uh, a lot of people have been asking me they bought coin uh, due to the predictions they have from lunar crush and then now the coin is going down and uh, they are looking at selling it now let me say to you that cryptocurrency actually fluctuates and uh, it goes down today and tomorrow it might go up and sometimes it might go down for one month two months it will be done and then after the third month it start coming back up so that is how cryptocurrency is i just want to say to you welcome to the world of cryptocurrencies okay now i want to make some things clear to you now that you are now in the world of cryptocurrency you bought coin and your coin is dipping right now what and what do you need to know uh, I, just like I said, you are welcome. So, uh, cryptocurrency generally is something that does not stay in a single place. Now, even if crypto, even forex trading, the same thing. When a market is going up, it does not just go up straight up. Okay, when it's going up, it goes up. Like let's say it goes up and then it reverses like twenty percent and then goes up again. Okay, like uh, hundred percent again and then reverses like thirty percent and then goes up again. So that's how it goes up. When it's coming down, the same thing happens. It's not just straight down. It comes down, then move up a bit and then comes down and then move up a bit. So currently now we are in the deep. Even though the market has been uh, quite bullish for some uh, for some months uh, before now, but then it's currently in the deep, and I have the settings that I'm using for bullish settings, and it's what I showed you in my previous video. And currently now, majority of you that have done the hundred shot that I put, you might have exhausted all the hundred shot. Now the question is, how do I get out of the deep? I'm currently also in the deep, and even though I'm in the deep, I'm still making some money. Even though it's lower, but I'm still making some money. And now, how do I get out of the deep? And this is the sweetest part of cryptocurrency. And the reason why I said you are welcome to the world of cryptocurrency because you are in the world where you will be financially free. Okay, you will be liberated from poverty, and you will now be free. Now, coins can go down. Now, when you buy one thousand Shiba Inu, for example, and then maybe you buy one thousand Shiba Inu for let's say ten dollars. Okay, now the value of that Shiba Inu can go down. Now, what you bought for ten dollar, one thousand Shiba, you know, you bought for ten dollar. The value might go down to let's say uh, four dollars. Now, if the value of the Shiba, you know, you bought for ten dollar goes down to four dollar, do you know what happens? Your one thousand Shiba, you know, still remains in your wallet. It is only the value that goes down. If you sell when it is now four dollar, when one thousand dollar, when one thousand Shiba, you know, is now four dollar, you lose. You lose. You are the one that lose. You are on the loss side because you sold when the market is down. Now, what you need to know is that patience is key in cryptocurrency, okay? Patience is key. We will soon resume back to the bullish trend, but while we are in the bearish trend, and on Royal Q, you have made all your shots. You have used all your 100 shots that you can shoot, you can actually use. I'm talking about the margin calls, and now what do you do? Now, I don't want to wait. Now, majority of the coins are down by 50% now. I will not want to wait until the market move forward by 50% before I break even. What do I need to do? There's something we call manual replenishment. Now, you can do it manually as well, and you can do it on Royal Q. And I'm going to show you how manual replenishment is done. Now, before you do manual replenishment, you just have to understand that you must look for support levels. Okay, uh, I have some support levels I have drawn on my uh, chart, and even some of these support levels can be broken. Okay, currently now, why we are in the deep is just because BTC, which is the father of all, or let me say, father or mother of all cryptocurrency, is currently dipping. And when BTC is hit with a dip, every other hot coin, 90% of other coins, or let me say, 90 to 95% of other coins will also follow the same process okay so when bitcoin is going down every coin goes down from the beginning of uh, april 2022 uh btc has been going deeply down 
and that has affected every other alternative coin that we have and they are also going down royal q has done its best to make more profit for me while it is going down but even with that it will still get to a point if it goes beyond my 100 margin calls it will still keep going down and the only option i have is to wait and secondly is to do manual replenishment and in this video i'm going to show you the result of my royal q how deep the current trades I am is and then what I need to do I need to do manual replenishment if I want but because of the way crypto BTC is going down now I will advise that anybody uh, that is in the deep should just wait now when it's time to do manual replenishment I will still give you an update that okay at this time BTC is getting stable and we can start doing manual replenishment now so that immediately just move 10% up or 5% up we are out of the deep with massive profit and we are out so that's one thing i want you to know okay so i'll quickly take you over to my phone now and quickly show you how this process is done and then we can uh, uh go ahead so uh no currently now i'm on my phone and the first thing i want to do is to click on the lunar cross let's look at some lunar cross predictions uh that have happened in the last three days even though it's been a month i made video let's look at some lunar cross prediction that have happened let's try to see if those uh predictions have actually come true and then if they come true let us see uh, how they actually uh, uh, okay now i've not been trading i've not been using lunar cross prediction for some time now because i already have like six coins i'm trading that they are in the deep and i don't have more fun to continue trading any other coin so you don't need to trade every coin that you have on lunar crush you don't have to do that okay you only trade the ones that you have the fund to trade and when you no longer have any fund you stop trading predictions okay just look for ways to manage the one you are currently trading now this is the coin of the day that was given yesterday to today okay and then in the next six hours another one will be given going to notifications right there uh let's see let me just um i'll be doing the last three days prediction but you can see there are a lot of predictions that have been predicted even in the last one month uh that have not been online to show you guys but i think it's necessary we do this update so the last three months you can see we have sand okay now let's let me go to binance and go and search for sand let's do in the last let's check the last three days if sand actually performed well okay so uh i just want my binance to load up wealth for me so that i can show you what i'm talking about let's see if okay you can see now btc is at 36 thousand for, for 36 thousand you know the last time i made video it was at around 40 something thousand maybe 43 thousand or so but now it's at 40 36 thousand it has gone down okay and then uh, let me start for sand which is predicted three days ago as a lunar crush coin of the day and let's see how it is doing you can see in the last three days just count the last three candles you can see what happened it actually went up okay that was uh, around uh, 24 to 48 hours it went up okay it went up and then yesterday it came down and today's candle just started around 1 a.m in the morning nigerian time so uh it actually went up three days ago the market was actually bullish so if you traded sand i didn't trade it because i don't have the phone to do that uh, okay so uh you will be in profit by now the next one we have is wave and that's two days ago and then let me search for wave right here so that you can see uh that as well wave okay waves uh, you can see right here with usdt and you can see even two days ago you like cast the last two candles you can see two days ago it was also bullish okay it was bullish as well so uh it was bullish and then you can also make profit if you invested but but now if you do not take your profit on time by now you'll be in the deep again okay so that's two days ago and then 18 hours ago you can see that we have anc so let me quickly go and search for that and let's see anc3 if we can have it right here okay we don't have the three but we have anc usdt so let me click on that so that you can see it's even already doing it's bullish already you can see uh between yesterday and today it has been going bullish so if you invested in this coin uh you will be employed by now even though this is not anc3 but we have anc here and is bullish so uh that means lunar crush is actually doing a beautiful job it might not be available on real cube but it's actually doing a beautiful job but there are some coins they predicted like the high ost that i traded and it never came true okay now let's the one they trade the predicted last four days which is um a real let's see real usdt you see is doing minus 16 percent already but if you look at the last four days one two three four you can see if you traded it in the last four days and you invested you will have make a little bit of profit and if you do not take the profits by now you will be in the deep again okay so uh because we are in the in the in the bearish trend okay the market is going down even if you trade any lunar crush coin you trade it immediately you are able to make three to five percent you just take your profit fast and then leave it because the market is dipping right now 
this is the best time for anybody to buy coin okay uh, because as this market is dipping you are buying more at a cheaper rate which is best okay you are buying more at a cheaper rate and it is the best thing so if you don't have royal queue for example this is one of the best time for you to get it because the market is already down almost 50 percent now and if you are buying at this time you are already at an advantage of 50 percent now i used to draw trend line you can see this trend line here there is a very strong resistance uh, support point at this point but because btc is going down it broke the support line and started going down again now assume it did not break this support line this is the best place for me to actually put my manual replenishment okay i will put my manual replenishment immediately it's this trend line i put my manual replenishment and when it bounces up i'm going to get out of the trade as fast as possible but it keep going down and the btc is still going down now okay so you can take advantage of the opportunity that the price is cheaper now and it's less now okay but at the same time can it still go down yes and that's the more reason why i will not be doing manual replenishment now for btc or any coin i want btc to uh, reach the minimum point and then when btc gets stable then i will start doing manual replenishment so for now i'm not doing manual replenishment on any of those coins uh of the, on any of these coins for now okay but when it gets stable i'm still going to get you updated as to when to do manual replenishment so that we can maximize our uh, profit now the fact that i'm not making profit right now does not mean i will still not make it because all these profits is accumulating for me by the time i do manual replenishment and i'm out of the trade you will see the massive profit that will come with it okay so that's how that is i'm still going to take you over to royal q to to show you the profit i've made now new which is one of the coins i'm trading on on royal q you can see i have my trend lines as well just like i've shown you and then uh it's been down just like btc every other coin just follow btc and they are currently down and in the last 24 hours is doing minus 11 percent that's massive okay so uh, i have it here i have my trend line set and they've broken all the trend lines Okay, they've broken all the trend lines and they are going down and down as BTC is going down. So this time, current markets are going down. Well, can I buy? Yes, you can buy at this time. Can you invest in Royal Q? Yes, you can invest because already 50% above already for yourself. Now, this is cake and cake also. I know this daily candle cake also has been going down. It has been going down, 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 down. So I invested in it as well and I'm the, the, I'm down like 20% or 20-70%, but you can see it here, it's still down, that's because BTC is down. Now, cake is predicted on normals to be going up, but because BTC is down, even normal predictions, lunar cross predictions, majority of them are still going against it because BTC is down. But that does not mean cake will still not go up. That does not mean new will still not go up. All these coins will go back up because there is a particular point they need to reach at the, up, at the uh, upper side but they have not reached those levels so they we just need to be patient until when these coins started coming back up now i have the runner here it's not available on real queue but i am trading it manually okay so and uh, it's actually there and you can see my trend line it broke the trend line here you know you have three points right here and this trend line is valid it broke the trend line here okay why because btc is going down assuming it does not break this trend line this is the best position for me to put in my manual replenishment and i'll be out of the trade as fast as possible but for now i'm still waiting for btc to be stable before i do any manual replenishment now when i get to react i will show you how manual replenishment is done now iost is another coin and i've invested a lot of money in iost now since the time lunar crush predicted iost i started trading it and then when it moves down to some percentage i actually decided to do manual replenishment <coughs> but uh because btc gets a very massive hit and was moving down fast that manual replenishment didn't work it actually worked against me because bt uh, ios keep going down as btc is going down it keeps going down so uh, currently now i've invested a lot in it and then at this point you can see this base level here it has reached another support level and this support level is a very strong support level even though btc is moving down fast it has reached this level and it's already ranging it's not moving down it's just ranging at this level and this is a very strong support line and if at all i want to do manual replenishment iost is a coin i can go ahead and do manual replenishment for now because this level is a very strong support level and even though btc is going down it does not really have a impact 
on on high OST. So high OST is at a good level to do manual replenishment. But then I don't have fun to do it, so I will still be waiting. Okay, I will be taking each of the coins out of the deep one after the other. As I take one out of the deep, and then I will use the phone to take the other one to do manual replenishment for the other one, and take the other one out of the deep. So I will follow that process until all of these coins are out of the deep. Okay, so uh, that's just that on high OST, and then I think I will. I also want to look at the last. Uh, coin I'm trading now before I take you over to Royal Q and also to Nomix uh, to show you uh, to show you how well uh, my coins are performing and then the latest update on what to do. So if your coin is going down, please do not sell. Do not sell. Now the next one I have is the Theta and Hitita. You can see it's also going down from the first of April. That was when BTC started going down and every other coin uh, follows suit. Okay, every other coin follows suit. So. Uh, every coin is going down. You can see my trend line as well. Got broken at this level, reverses back, and then goes down. So uh, we are in the deep. We are still waiting for stabilization in BTC. Immediately BTC gets stable, every other coin gets stable. Shiba Inu is the last one I have here, which is also another coin I'm trading on uh, Royal Q. Okay, so you should know that by now I've invested a lot in in cryptocurrencies, and then. Uh, uh, I'm waiting for for them to get stable. So you can see now, Shiba Inu initially as well got down and then it's moved up a bit and then start going down uh, again. So it's also down and then we'll be waiting. So I'll be showing you on my real queue uh, how this is working and what is uh, actually happening to them. So I think it's necessary I update you guys so that you don't begin to think that Noah has put us in the dark and it's not seeing anything again. Okay, so uh, that's why I'm giving this update now. Uh, if you go to let, let's just look at coin generally, okay. Apart from BTC, when I told you BTC is going down, every other coin is going down. Apart from this girl, okay, and it's a new coin, you can see this is a daily candle, it was listed around 24 hours ago, just a bit above 24 hours ago, and that's why it's doing well. Every other coin is going red, you can see red, 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 minus 12 percent, minus 17 percent, you see, minus 9 percent, minus 10 percent. You see, all coins are going down, all coins are going down. That's why I say 90 to 95 percent of coins are. Coins Currently, when BTC go down, they all follow suit. Okay, so that's just one of the things you need to get yourself familiar with when it comes to the world of cryptocurrency. It's not going to be going bullish every day. Okay, but the settings I'm using is the settings that when it start going bullish, you start taking advantage of the bullish opportunity. You maximize bullish opportunity to the fullest, and that's why I love the settings. That's why I never give you a, a bearish settings. I always do a bullish settings. Okay, during bearish time, what we do is manual replenishment, and it's one of the best things you can do for yourself, and you'll be glad you do. So you can see coins are going down, and this is I'm not surprised with this because it is what it is, and it is what happens in crypto currencies okay we have hot coins we have top gainers here you can see this guy now is a coin just listed around 24 hours or more and it has done almost 1000 percent you see it's done a lot of percent but now right now it's at 998 percent okay so we have multi btc right here it has been listed for a long time now but still it's one of the coins that is doing bullish now okay so you can see dots down and these are some of the coins that are just doing a bit of bullish now in the last 24 hours okay so but majority of the coins you can see top losers here majority of the coins are actually going down so it's not about lunar cross predictions it's not about nomic predictions at this moment in time this is what is happening to btc and it's impacting every other coin so can i still trade lunar crush can i still trade nomic of course if you are joining us today if you want to you know trade cryptocurrency to, you want to start trading cryptocurrency today still look for lunar cross prediction still look for normal prediction before you actually go ahead to trade because those coins they actually predicted will actually go the way they said just that it's a matter of time when btc gets stable they will start uh, going that direction now i have no mix right here and uh, i just wanted to fully load so that you can see uh how what their predictions is and that they are still standing on their predictions even though by 1 a.m nigerian time at midnight midnight by 1 a.m they used to predict uh they used to do an update of all the coins they are trading but you can see all of them are red all of them all coins are showing red 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 so all of them are down and it's due to uh the father btc which is the father and mother of all cryptocurrency is actually going down so there is nothing to worry about absolutely nothing what you just need is patient a little bit of patience and a little bit of time to be able to know when to do manual replenishment and get out of the deep 
if you have a phone as fast as possible okay so that's basically what it is let me do uh seven days predictions to, to just you know filter this out and then show you what Nomics is still predicting on the coins i'm currently trading you know i'm trading you see this running now it's one of the coins that I predicted for a long time that is going to do well and currently now even though it's down 10 percent they still keep predicting it's going to do well new is another one and it's one of the ones i'm trading on uh, a royal queue and the predictor is going to do well but it's down 11 percent right now but they still predict it's gonna do well it's at 17 they said it's still going to uh 23 so no problem we have flow as well which is one of the coins i was trading but i've actually sold it when it gave me profit then i sold it manually on binance and then i have a profit but it's still there and they still have a prediction that is going to do well so these coins are still predicted no miss is still standing on his ground that these coins are still the best coins to do well in the coming days and weeks okay so even though btc is impacting them even though they are going down but we still have a firm belief they are going to do well and you don't want to miss this opportunity now pancake swag is one of the ones i'm trading as well and even though it's still going down they still believe it's gonna do well so these coins are still going to do well but even though they are down now when is the best time for you to buy now that it's down can it still go down more yes but just be aware that uh, the best time one of the best time you can buy is now if you have not registered on royal queue take advantage of the opportunity as it's going down now you'll be buying and selling and even if it goes down beyond your number of margin calls you still have to wait like we are doing but there is no best time for you to do it than now you have to get start getting yourself familiar with cryptocurrencies and when you do you are going to understand how it, how, how it works if you say you want to wait you might be waiting and you wake up one morning and find out that all these cryptocurrency bitcoin that is down to 36 percent 36 thousand has gone to 45 thousand and you will say oh what if i know i bought at uh, 36 thousand so these are some of the opportunities that exist i uh, would rather buy cryptocurrency now that it's down and wait for it to come up than think wow wow it can go down and if it goes down i will be losing money now <clears throat> let me quickly show you you can see my coins are down but let me quickly show you the results you can see today which is sixth of may okay you can see friday 6th of may okay i have not accumulated any profit today but as i yesterday 5th of may i still make 2.7 dollar the day before yesterday i still made 1.5 dollars okay uh on the third let me just start from on the first okay first of uh april first of april you can see 47 dollars i never made video on i think the last video i made was on 31st of of march okay so april 1st i still made 47 dollars second 11 and then third 25 then after 25 on the fourth i made 46 you can see it right here it's something that you can see even though on the first of april the coin was going down but i was making my own profit then when it gets to on the sixth the profit start reducing start declining 6.4 3.3 7.5 7.0 then for 3.5 then 6 then you see on the 13 i have 23 dollars right here it came up a bit and then from that now from the on the 13th then uh it start going down again 0 0.7 okay 0 0.1 0 0.1 and then there are some days that i don't have any profit at all on the 18 you can see on the 19th it's not no profit then on 21 then from 21 of april no profit until on the first of may okay i don't make any profit because the coin was dipping more and i don't have more fun to continue trading it now so from the first now till on the fifth i'll be making money but it is very little 0 0.4 2.5 0 0.7 1 point so that's how it is so i just want to i will make you aware that i'm still making little little profit even though it's still not uh, it's not much but it's not like the one i showed you initially now look at shiba inu usdt which is one of the coin i'm trading it has actually made 100 calls okay but it's down by 25 percent and you can see 263 dollars okay so it's down already i can do manual replenishment but i'm not going to do it now because i want btc to be stable now another coin i'm trading is btc itself because it's one of our lunar cross predictions at a particular time point in time so i decided to trade it i made some profit from it and i'm still making profit in fact the profit you saw that i just showed you night from btc uh, it has only made 37 costs even though it's going down now i only set it to 37 costs and that's why i have it but assuming i wanted to do manual replenishment for btc now okay uh what do i need to do look at the amount that i've been invested in it okay i've invested 528 okay so i come here and put market order market price and i put exact amount or i put a little bit like 530 you can see i put 530 here now 11 if i put if i inject 530 into btc now okay what will happen is if you move from minus 11 percent to minus 5.49 percent that's manual replenishment for you you assume i have 530 dollar in my balance in my usdt uh, balance now wallet address now spot wallet now 
and I click on confirm right here this amount is going to be invested on BTC now okay Royak is going to invest it for me and it will move from minus 11% to minus 5.49% okay maybe you don't understand what I'm saying now I can increase this amount okay you see that when I invest in uh, input 530 which is almost the same amount I've invested before it divided it into two okay now if I put $1,000 see what will happen it will move BTC that is already in minus 11% for me we move from minus 11% to minus 3.8% let me put $2,000 if I invest $2,000 in BTC now okay doing with manual replenishment you move from minus 11% to minus 2.29% so if Bitcoin just moved by 2.29% up, I will break even. Then if you move by 1.3% more, I'm going to be in profit and it's going to do what? It's going to dump BTC for me because I put it on one shot already. Okay? So immediately it came out in profit with 1.3%, then I'll, I'll make profit. So now it's at minus 2. Point, if I click OK now, okay, with 2,000, I inject 2,000 to give me minus 2.29%. Now, if you just move up by 2.28%, it will break even then if you move up by 1.3 percent more then i make problem so if you move up by 3.5 now i'm going to take profit and it's going to dump the coin for me and i will make my profit on it that is what we call manual replenishment now when i dump btc i will go to another coin that i see that has uh less uh uh down that is less down that doesn't go down much okay i will also go there and do manual replenishment okay and then it will also reduce the amount immediately just move five ten percent I'm out of that as well. I will take the phone, gather it together as well, move to the next coin, and go and do manual replenishment. And I will be doing it as uh, uh, this actually goes on. So you can see my coins are down minus 11, minus 26 percent, minus 47 percent, 40 percent, 37 percent. And this high OST, I invested a lot into it, okay? Because I've done manual replenishment before, but because BTC is going down, it actually went against me. So this is exactly how it is done. I just think it's necessary i update you guys so that you know that i'm not leaving you in the deep it's actually how cryptocurrency works and we are come we are going to bounce back i will teach you how to do manual replenishment to bounce back from any deep you are you are in 40 percent deep you are in 50 percent deep there is a way to go about it and i'm going to be updating you guys on how to go about it on this note i'll be closing and saying to you see you in my next video and bye for now